Etna lava stones fall on towns and villages in the Sicily, uh, in Italy. <laughs> that's that's sad in a way, but these people are used to live with it. This is a market you see people have walked on the ash and left their footprints. They're taking selfies. They're enjoying it. The the fertile the fertility of the soil there is because of this uh, ashfall. Of course, it can scratch your car, unfortunately. So these are very sharp, angular, angular uh, stones. And uh, yeah, you can leave a you know a memory also on the stone, write something on it. And uh, yeah, the plants and everything was covered. It's it's just a trouble for people to have to you know blow out all this uh, ash. It costs a lot for the government in Italy to actually do this. I hope countries like Lithuania and uh, Poland which all the time are receiving free money from the EU, will also come and chip in some money to help the Italians. They went there to take jobs anyway. And uh, now this is the situation. African plate going under Eurasian plate. That's the uh, subduction. And this subduction creates melts which erupt as the Etna volcano, one of the most active volcanoes in, in Europe. This is a thermal image. shows which part, parts are the hottest parts. And you can see, the, of course, the tip of the volcano where the eruption is happening is hottest.